evangelist Fernando Press here. Today I'm praying for those in need of mental clarity and direction. If you are in need to experience a breakthrough in this area of your life, then please pray along with me. Let's believe God for a fresh anointing from heaven to touch your life. I'm standing with you according to the Word of God found in Psalms chapter 37, verse 23 and verse 24. The Bible says, The Lord makes firm the steps of the one who delights in Him. Verse 24, Though he may stumble, he will not fall, for the Lord upholds him with his hands. Amen? And so let's pray. Let's call on the name of the Lord. I'm praying specifically for direction and I'm praying for clarity of mind. I'm asking the Lord to touch your life today in Jesus' name. Amen? Would you join me right now? Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of your Son, Jesus, today I stand in prayer as a minister of the gospel, asking you that you touch my precious brother and sister. Father God, today we are praying specifically for mental clarity and for direction. Direction concerning today, direction concerning tomorrow, direction concerning our future, concerning our destiny. Father God, everything that blocks, everything that hinders them to receive clarity of mind, to receive direction from above, we ask, Lord God, for a fresh anointing from heaven to deliver them in your precious mighty name. Father God, today I'm praying for this man, this woman that is dealing with a high level of stress. Lord God, whatever it is that is causing this stress, that is triggering this stress, Father God, I pray that you touch my brother and my sister. Every one of you, people of God, just lay your hand on top of your head. Ask the Lord to touch your mind. Ask the Lord to touch you. Just surrender this area, this situation to the Lord, whatever it is that is causing stress, that is causing anxiety, fear in your life, just give to the Lord, surrender to Him right now. Father, right now as your people, they lay their hands on top of their head. I pray, Lord God, would you release that fresh anointing from heaven? Only your anointing can bring healing to my brother and my sister. Some of them, Lord God, their lives are out of order. There's so many things, Father God, that they need to bring back into order. There's so many of them, Lord God, dealing with a stressful situation. Some of them, they are dealing, Lord God, with a difficult, with a complicated situation. And that's what is triggering. That is what's causing, Lord God, this mental block, this lack of clarity. Father God, I pray right now, touch each one of them. I pray right now, Father God, for a special anointing to come upon them and to break the yoke of bondage, to break every stronghold of stress, anxiety, and fear. I say, loose in Jesus' name. Right now, come out of them. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray for the healing power of Jesus to come upon their mind and to bring everything back into normal. Everything in order right now. Everything that is out of alignment, everything that is out of order, all the chaos in the mind, all the strongholds in the mind, I say, broken in Jesus' name, loose them right now in Jesus' name, I command every mental stronghold, I say, broken by the power of Jesus, I plead the blood of Jesus right now, and I say, a stronghold of the mind, mental fatigue, I say, Broken Jesus' name. Broken Jesus' name. Loose them right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I pray that you touch this man, that you touch this woman in the mind. Lord God, everything that is causing this oppression in the mind, I say, broken by the power of Jesus. I release the anointing that is in my life to set the captives free. Lord God, I release your anointing to undo the powers of oppression, the powers of depression. I say, 
broken right now in Jesus' name. Now I'm praying for my brother and my sister dealing with negative thinking. Father God, I pray, break the yoke of negative thinking. This man, this woman, Father God, that is dealing, Lord God, with this negative thinking. It seems that they cannot break free from this pattern. I pray, set them free. Break the yoke of captivity, Lord God, in Empower them. Help this man, this woman to renew their minds. Show them the importance of renewing their minds daily in the Word of God. Your Word declares, Father God, that we are to renew our minds so that we can know your will for our lives. Lord God, I pray the grace, the anointing of God to come upon this man, this woman, to break the yoke of negative thinking. I say broke in Jesus' name. Loose them in Jesus' name. I pray. I rebuke anxiety. I rebuke confusion. I rebuke lack of focus. I rebuke lack of concentration. I pray, Father God, touch my brother, my sister. I pray for clarity of mind. I pray that my brother, my sister will be able to walk in a realm of clarity of mind that they have not been able to. I pray, Father God, for the anointing to undo the yoke of bondage. Father God, your word declares that all things are possible for those that believe. I believe, Father God, that as we are praying today, you are touching them. This is not a waste of time. We are not wasting our time praying to you. We believe in prayer. We believe in a power of agreement in your name. And so, Father God, let everything that is causing mental barriers, mental blockades, Lord God, I pray pray, let this thing be broken, let this thing come down, let my brother, my sister receive clarity, I'm praying, Lord God, specifically for clarity of mind, I'm praying, Lord God, for direction, some of them, they are in a transition right now in their job, they are in a transition in their career, they are in a transition from moving from one place to the next, I pray, Father God, give my brother, my sister clarity, give them direction concerning their future. I pray, Father God, for answers. Some of them, they are in desperate need of an answer. They are crying to you right now. They are asking, oh Lord God, for clarity concerning their future. I pray, make their path straight. Make their path clear. I pray for clarity concerning their future. I pray for clarity concerning their destiny. I pray for fulfillment. I pray for a strong anointing coming upon them to do the will of God, to do what you call them to do on this earth. Lord God, I bless them. I commend every oppression, every heaviness, everything that caused Lord God mental blockades and barriers. Lord God, complicate situations. I say Break in Jesus' name. I pray, Father God, for those who are battling, Lord God, with lack of energy, those who are battling with insomnia, those who are battling, Lord God, with unwanted thoughts and memories. I ask for your healing power to touch them, to bring deliverance into their lives. Father, I bless my brother and my sister today, and I declare that all the heaviness, all the things that was coming against them, Lord God, hindering them to have clarity. I say, broken in Jesus' name. Father, I declare freedom. I declare deliverance. I declare insight. I declare revelation. I pray that you begin to visit them. Even today, Lord God, to dreams and visions, I pray, make their path straight. I pray, Father God, that you touch them, that you restore their lives, and I pray that you raise my brother and my sister to be a powerful testimony in your hand. I bless them and I bless them. Every one of you repeat this prayer with me. Say, Lord Jesus, I ask you, set me free. Empower me. Lord Jesus, I surrender my life to you and I ask you, let your kingdom come and let your will be done in my life today in your precious name. Amen 
and amen. Praise God, my brother, my sister. Just take a deep breath. Receive peace in your life. Receive the peace of God that surpasses all understanding. Receive right now in Jesus' name. I bless you in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Praise God. It's been such a great blessing to be able to pray and to stand with all of you again. If you've been blessed by this prayer, please like this video, subscribe to our channel. I love you. God bless you.